Swiggity Swag, what's in the bag, Jay here, and we got some more Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire news. Now, I know that a lot of people have been wanting Secret Bases um, re return to um, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, and that has been confirmed today. Yes, 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 the official Pokemon website has confirmed that Secret Bases are coming back in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. So what I'm going to do is I'm basically going to read a little bit of what they have on the official website. Um, you can go ahead and check the video description for the official website to read all about it. But I'm just going to go over a few things that stuck out to me and I'm going to give you guys my opinions and stuff on that. Um, also, if you will, please leave, leave this video a like. It helps support the channel and the video and it just makes me a very happy guy. But let's go ahead and jump into this brand new news because i i mean i for one have not been one of those i wasn't one of those people who was you know so super crazy about secret bases but seeing them return it does make me very 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 happy okay so basically it says you know create a secret base that's all your own including selecting and placing decorations however you like um like basically what you did in third gen in the third gen games but it also says you can make it like your very own pokemon gym and you can get ready for other players to come and challenge you because i think if you remember back in gen 3 you was able to battle um someone in their secret base so you can actually design it to make it look like a pokemon gym and you can be like a, a gym leader which i think that's kind of cool i like i like the way they worded that that, that makes it a little bit more friend not friendly it makes it a little bit more i guess interesting you know it makes it more appealing you know because it's like hey i got my own pokemon gym i mean it's my secret base but it's like a pokemon gym right so it also says using communication features it's easy to connect with other players around the world to share your secret base with one another which we couldn't do with regular ruby and sapphire and emerald okay you couldn't really uh, share your base around the world because 3DS now has that, you know, that feature where you can battle people from like across the uh, world and country and stuff. Now you can share your base with everybody in the world, which is really, really, really amazing. It also says when you visit another player's secret base, that base is, um, that base's members will be hanging out there. You can talk to them or even battle them. If you find base owners that you like, you can scout them as one of your own secret pals and bring them back to your own base, which I think that's pretty cool. So you can basically just collect your own squad and just have your own squad sitting there or 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 basically you know have like us like they said before a pokemon gym where you can basically have your squad as you know the gym trainers and you be the leader and then they just go through and battle you and destroy you or something i don't know you know what i mean that's it's cool i think that's pretty cool it says once you become secret pals of someone you can continue to have pokemon battles against them and also have your pal use special skills to support you on your adventure okay that's see that now i don't know what um special skills mean i guess maybe it's something kind of like o powers on the pss in x and y um i'm not necessarily sure if the pss will be returning but i think that's actually uh, a really cool thing you know i, I want to know what these special skills are because they sound like o powers to me um but you know we don't we don't we don't really know we don't we don't really know so uh yeah anyway it says another fun aspect of super secret bases is to capture the flag activity examine the flag behind the secret pc and another player's secret base to obtain it you can take one flag per day from each base visited visit lots of secret bases and collect lots of flags to improve your team's rank and get rewards including increasing the skill of your secret pals so i'm guessing that this is a, a way to boost the power of these special skills i would assume so i guess it's sort of kind of like you know if you continue to use like in x and y if you continue to use your o powers then they will get stronger essentially and then they'll level up so i'm guessing if you do this capture the flag activity it's it's essentially the same thing and you can increase your secret pals skills maybe i don't know i don't know i'm just speculating here so as it says um, on the website, flag colors will change based on a team's rank, so you can tell another team's rank at a glance, and others can tell yours. It also says you can share your super secret base with trainers all over the world, like we said before. Symbolize your secret base with a QR code. With the QR code, you can get the secret base of a particular player you've been wanting to visit, which I think that's actually really, really cool, because now like for like YouTubers, um, we can just put our code out on twitter or something and then basically like our fans or whatever can come up and just you know scan it with their um 3ds camera and then from there boom bang boom 
they have our secret base and they can battle us in our secret base you know so i think that's actually a really cool idea i think they probably took that idea from like what animal crossing when you was able to uh, get outfits and tiles and stuff with the qr codes i'm not sure but i think that's actually a really cool idea and not only that but it also says to help you get started with super secret bases you'll meet secret base expert are you see Arun, I'm not really sure how you pronounce his name, but it says Arun and his Flygon are world travelers bursting with excitement about secret, the secret base culture in the whole region. This enthusiastic adventure will teach you all about the fun of secret bases during your journey. So a lot of people have been saying Mega Flygon confirmed because this guy has a Flygon. Um, I'm not necessarily sure if Mega Flygon is in fact quote unquote confirmed, but um, that would be kind of cool if uh, you know he did have a Mega Flygon or something like that. I wonder if you if you get to battle him. I mean, if you get to battle him, that would be pretty cool. I think you do. Maybe I think there's a I think there's actually a battle screenshot of him as well. So I think that's actually pretty cool. Um, but let me let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. Are you excited for these secret bases? I I actually kind of am excited for these secret bases. But let me know in the comments. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.